If you've just gotten a new Samsung Frame TV, you're probably enjoying art mode and ambient mode. But what if you want something a little more personal up on the biggest screen in the house? I'm Erin from TechGadgetsCanada.com and first off, thank you for clicking on my video. With the Samsung Frame TV, particularly the 2021 edition here, it's possible to add your own photos and snapshots to the Frame TV and it's actually pretty easy. I'll show you exactly what to do, but first a quick heads up. If you end up liking this video and finding it helpful to please hit that like button and do consider becoming a subscriber. Both those things help me keep making more videos that I hope everyone out there gets to watch, enjoy, and learn from. To start with, you'll need the Samsung Smart Things app, and you'll need the app to control your TV with your phone anyway, and you can adjust all kinds of settings. In the Smart Things app, click on your TV, then choose art mode, select add your photos, then surf for and select the photos you'd like to bring over to the frame. Finally, choose save on the frame. Tap to choose the photo you want. You'll be able to add a mat for the photos if you like, and you can use different colors too. There's also an array of artistic effects that can make your photo look like a painting or a drawing if you want to go that far. Now it's worth noting that you can't really make any major photo editing adjustments directly on the TV or really inside the app. So it's best to make sure you do all of that before you send it to the television. Wondering if you can create a slideshow? You sure can. To create a slideshow, you'll follow the instructions that I just gave you, but before you choose your individual photo, select the slideshow or slideshow random option. That is how to add personal photos and family memories to your Samsung Frame TV, just like I did. If you want to read this article or reference any of what I've talked about or share it with someone else, head over to techgadgetscanada.com where I've got the full write-up posted. You can ask me any questions you have either there on the blog or, as always, here on the YouTube channel. Did this video help you? If so, please hit that like button and consider becoming a subscriber. Both those things help me keep making more videos that I hope everyone out there gets to watch, enjoy, and learn from. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Erin. Until the next time, you can find me on either Twitter or Instagram. I'm at ErinLYYC. You can also always catch me through Facebook at facebook.com slash techgadgetscanada.